Okay, what you're seeing here is a close-up of some ancient lithified sea ripples in a creek bed up at Stanbury Park in Cincinnati, Ohio. And Cincinnati, Ohio is world famous for our Ordovician fossils. Besides the uh, fossils we find here, we find the ripple marks left by this ancient tropical inland sea. These ripple marks were small to medium to very large. This is one of the more larger ones. And there's one here, there, and there. They're about the size of a telephone pole cut in half. It was covered up by other sediment and it has hardened. It is now a limestone rock. But these used to be soft mud that uh, were underneath the, underneath the sea. There's the dog for a scale. If I get low, you can see the outline a little better. It's a little hard to tell, but these are actually uh, lithified, fossilized sea ripples of the ancient sea floor, sea bed. And this section here is one big sea ripple. There's the next. There's another one. And a final one over there. This shows you how big it is compared to the dog. Okay, we have an interesting rock here. This is lithified mud, but what's unusual about it, it, it was above uh, water level, of the sea level, and it was cracked mud and had a lot of water going through it. This isn't found that often, because usually everything was under the sea. But this is, we were obviously near a place where it was sticking up above land and rainwater had, cr had made cracks in the mud, then the channels of water was r rushing through that, creating these erosion patterns don't see this too often. We're in the creek bed in Stanbury Park. This is a very deep uh, part of the cliff. We have a lot of clay exposed and limestone exposed. And the boys are walking along collecting clay and walking over all the limestone rocks. They're actually taking some clay home to do some uh, modeling clay with it. Just kind of scraping away some of the clay. There's a very thick limestone layer right above the boards. That's about 13 inches thick right there. And it continues all the way along. There it goes. 